Welcome back. We just got back from Texas State early this morning. We were able to win all five of our games. Uh, it was a good weekend for us. We definitely needed that. Uh, we had some good showings from some of our players. You know, Andy Varsha is just tearing it up at the plate, doing a good job. You know, Mary Gooding has been very solid for us at shortstop and hitting in the ninth spot. You know, we had some big hits and once again a lot of the small ball, which you know it helps us uh, put runners on. Uh, we scored quite a few runs this weekend, um, but at the same time we left some runners on base. So I think it's slowly getting to where it needs to go, which is good. We're not going to peak too soon. Um, hopefully, we're we're right on pace to where we need to be. This upcoming week, we head out to Baylor on Friday to play them in a three-game series, two on Saturday and one on Sunday, which will be a good test for us, um, not just good competition, but to play in a big stadium with a large crowd. Um, so it'll be nice to see how our kids respond to that, once again, like they did at LSU and Arizona. And then we play um, a couple of midweek games, which will be good for our kids, just to see a little more of Texas. I, I don't know why I have this thing with Texas this year. I just can't seem to get out of the state of Texas. Um, we've been very lucky so far with travel and weather, so I'm not going to make any complaints. Uh, hopefully we can finish out our uh, pre-conference games without uh, losing any games to weather and then head into conference uh, ready to go. So definitely looking forward to this upcoming weekend and a few games during spring break. Well, I think the reason we're not playing as many games spring break is we didn't give the team a weekend off um, before conference, and so their weekend off is going to be the weekend before we start pretty much conference. Uh, so just give them a little bit of time to get caught up in school, let their bodies recover, and just have time to be a college kid. You know, of course, still practicing and doing all that good stuff, but just time to recharge and get ready for Big Ten. Because what I like to do is divide up our season, um, you know, preseason, Big Ten, and then. Uh, hopefully, you know, postseason. So it's three different phases. That way we can put all our focus into one and then get ready for the next and then the next. You know, they need a break. You know, traveling can be very grueling and, and our kids have been doing a really great job and, and they deserve some time off if they do well this week.